Okay, 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 okay. So, new rotors and suspension overhaul on the 92 MR2. So here's the front suspension, control arm, trailing arm. It's got to go out. And here's the rear, same thing. I think that's a, is that a trailing or caster? I, I don't know. Either way, all the lower control arms, all the control arms, suspension, it's going out. Um, and I am going to be just grinding away at some rust and dirt. It's a 30 year old car, so this stuff has got to be replaced. Um, you can see here I'm hand pressing out all these old rubber bushings and we're going to be putting in some poly bushings in. Um, I did this on my other car and I always like to do this. Um, I was driving on this and cringing so hard, the suspension's been so blown. Um, so yeah, everything's out, old ball joints being pressed out, uh, new ones are going in as well. This is like purple power to help get off the dirt and grime. Then after this, I just grind away um, at all the rust and surface debris. And I refinish these in like a rust preventative paint. I used POR15. It's more cost effective. It was like 60 bucks to do it versus like a sandblast and powder coat, which would have ran me like six or 700 bucks cheap as I could find at least. Um, so yeah, you can see there I, um, I did a few light tack coats of primer and then two light coats of the uh, the blue POR15 followed by a, a medium heavy coat. And I'll let that sit for a few days to, to cure. And then I followed with a 2k clear. Um, so yeah, it's pretty good. I mean, if you're on a budget, this saves so much money. Um, as a nicety, I can get, get the arms powder coated later on. But for now, this is good. It's good enough. Um, yeah, those are the new ball joints, poly bushings, everything here. I learned a new trick uh, to reduce squeaking. Um, never done it myself yet until now, but um, it's wrapping these in Teflon tape and then lubing them. Um, so apparently that helps with the squeakiness that'll come with the poly bushings after a few years. So I tried it out, see what happens. Um, I had my other car for about a year with poly bushings without the Teflon tape. Never noticed any squeaking, but um, I'm sure eventually it would happen. Um, but yeah, we'll see how these hold up. And there's me pressing them in. Still go a, a lot longer than I expected. Probably about a week just between painting and drying the coats and then repainting again. And then about a, just a half a day dedicated to Pressing in the bushings and installing. You can see here I have Megan trailing arms. Um, for some reason, the old arm bushing sleeves, they didn't fit on the OEM ones. I think they were the wrong trailing arms, maybe from an AW11. I don't know. But uh, I ordered some OEM ones. I'll always have the option to go back. But uh, yeah, it's a pretty quick bid on the suspension restore. So that's it.